Sigh. All right, you're good. Look at this drop. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to another adventure here in Colorado. We finished camping in Telluride area. So the plan is yeah, to heading out to uh, Imogene Pass. So we are actually at the trailhead of Imogene Pass right now. So this, I think it's about 12 miles all the way to Ure. That's the plan for today. So we're gonna check this trail out. Another trail, awful list of trails to do here in Colorado. But uh, yeah, let's, uh, there's six of us and let's get this trail started. Let's do it. So guys, the first, uh, I would say about mile, two miles or so, is the steepest, I guess apparently the hardest section. We climbed from around 8,500 to 10,500. So it's definitely an uh, uphill climb, the first one or two miles. And there's a lot of rock here and there, but not hard. I mean, just four high right now. I mean, yeah, yet to use four low. But it's beautiful though. You get to see over the side of the mountain and tell you right. And Man, it's just gorgeous here. There's a sweet view. All right, Laura, jump. <laughs> oh, man. Look at Scott, his face is just with glee, right? With glee. Look at this view. Yeah. Will you look at it? Will you look at it? Look at the view. That's so pretty. Not too much. Yes. Yes. No. A little break of this abandoned mine town. That's pretty neat. So many little mine shafts around. But man, the view. Can't imagine how hard these guys worked back in the days to get these stuff up in this mountain. Man, true pioneers of their days. 
But just us, so far we saw only saw one side by side. Oh man, this is, we're almost at the peak, 13,000, I think that's the peak up there, but man, what a view, guys. This is hard, that section where the ghost town start, we have to use for low and I have to use my ETC because you can feel that the truck was struggling. It's very steep, but what a view, look at that. You know, see all the way down to tell you right. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. Still a little bit more to go and then we'll reach the top. I believe it's 13,000 something up here. Alright, we're at the peak. It's like 13,200 and something. Oh my gosh. What a view, what a view. Man, it's ridiculous. This George. <laughs> Man, what a view up here. So we made it in about two, two and a half hours. I think we started around nine o'clock, nine-ish. It's around 11.30 right now. But uh, what a beautiful, beautiful trail. 13,000, a little bit over 13,200 feet, I believe. So we are descending down into Ure right now. From the look of it, we're halfway, obviously, but it says about six miles left. So the descent shouldn't be too complicated from what I heard. But uh, yeah, towards well, after the mining town is de definitely get really steep, and uh, four low would be great to go up those steep, steep section. So yeah, we got a few maybe do a lunch stop along the way. Maybe hopefully we can get down to some of those um, trees line and then find a spot. But yeah, it's pretty windy up here. It's beautiful though. Got to concentrate on driving. Ah. <laughs> All right, let's continue. Woo! <laughs> uh, nice flexing shot right there. Going to the steep section.
little there, uh, little hitch love. All right, I believe I got a pretty good knocking on the slider. Oh yeah. Oh, that's like, as long as my diff doesn't get hit, that's all I'm concerned about. So right, easier, moderate, harder. Supposedly there's a couple of shells down there, so I think from that should be hopefully it. This guy, you're next. Okay. You're next. Are you gonna have a drop on your passenger side coming up in about three feet? You can use a harder line here, guys. Right, or stick to the three, left. Two, one, you're dropping right now. You're dropping right now, your passenger. Your hitch will receive right there. Here. All right, straight now, you should be fine. Man, look at the views. Man, we got such good weather. Wow, it's ridiculously gorgeous right now, guys. Some skids happen right now, but they're not tire skids. <laughs> you gotta kiss me with the truck. Come on. Kiss me with the truck. One more beat. Passenger is gonna drop slowly. Slowly. There you go. Straight back. Keep going. Okay, passenger is gonna drop here in a minute. Get ready. Slow, slow. All right. Yeah, not sure it was the elevation or what, but that was pretty. My heart was pounding for sure. All right, Scott's up. It's definitely the money shot area. All right, train out, train out. Just slowly crawl. Up. You got it. There you go. Crawl up. There you go. Crawl up. A little more, a little more. All right, you're good. Look at this drop. Oh my god, it's beautiful. All right, straight out, you're good, you're good. Just slowly climb up. Just 
Just straight, yeah, just straight. Let those wheels work. There you go. Yeah, just slow, slow. Climb up. Climb up. A little more, a little more. Just climb, climb. A little more. All right, perfect. Uh, definitely a busy area. So many Jeeps are coming up. Side by side, just left. But man, what a cool shot. What a cool view in general. So, look at that. Wow. Couple of noodle going, shrimp flavor today. What a cool place to chill though. Yeah, explore that mine a little bit. But we're all the way up there. What are you guys having? We got apple. The most nutritious we got Arizona. Energy. She's bringing the string cheese. <laughs> Like today. Good Shay. What are you having, Shay? Everyone's having Arizona. <laughs> Is there a Colorado iced tea? Uh -uh. Made a gourmet. Adding a bunch of spinach. Help me poop in this high elevation. Ooh, so well tip. Oh, it's gonna be good. Just missing an egg and some spam. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. My, my, my. Man, what a fun trail. We finished uh, lunch. Now we're heading out. I uh, should hit the main road pretty soon, a few more miles, but uh, what a place to chill and hang out for the day. So, yeah, we got a few more miles. Actually, river crossing coming up pretty soon. That's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, it's, it's uh, beautiful here, guys.
Alright guys, we are finished with Imogene Pass. We are almost uh, in Ure right now. Plan is trying to get a hotel and uh, yeah, wash up a little bit. It's been a few days, <laughs> so we are not smelling all that great. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys like that trail. Man, that trail was really, really fun. I think I like it better than Black Bear Pass. Black Bear Pass is just gnarly and scary. But Imogene is just, there's technical, but also there's beautiful, uh, just the trail condition is beautiful. So you do learn how to pick your line, rocky section, and all that kind of spotting and all that's needed there. But man, the trail is really beautiful. And uh, we're almost into Ure. Man, the view here is just gorgeous. The mountain is just pink, blue, and Right, it's awesome. So yeah, join us one more day tomorrow. Gonna be another epic one. I'm trying to do more overlanding. Gonna be head towards Alpine Loop, and we're gonna spend I think two days out there in the trail. I think it's about 100 miles of off-roading in that loop. But we'll see how much we can do. But definitely, we're spending two nights out there in the back country. All right. Well, you hope you if you guys like this content, consider subscribing and supporting our channel, right, babe? <laughs> like, comment, yeah. share, all the stuff. We'll want the uh, new shirt, so. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, catch you guys on the Alpine Loop video.